The, the, I just love what Ultimate Planet do as, as a company. I, I love the, the time they invest in the community. Uh, I love the, uh, the, how they can use resources that's around. So when they came with an idea, I knew that these girls would get it made. I basically got really on board when Kristen from Tello came back and basically said she's interested in taking it at Series 1. Uh, Tello's a distributor uh, in America who's basically, uh, they, they pick it up for a subscription channel, which is great because you already know um, there's a niche market out there who are wanting this type of content. So we intentionally went for an open audition. We said, if you feel you identify and would like to be involved in this project, please audition. So we've had um, actresses come along who've never acted they're, they're actresses today because of what we've created. Um, and that's really refreshing, it's really nice because they bring an honesty to the role. Today we were filming um, a sex scene between two of the characters and these characters have known themselves, known each other for years and years and years. So we had to come in with a real sensibility of know your character, know what you're getting into, know the desire of these characters, then film it in a way that the actors were really comfortable in acting you know, and also have the trust in us as a team on a close set who is going to film it the best we can and respect them as, as, as people before the character. In a sense not so challenging because the actors trusted and that's more than I could have asked for. So it was good. You're never going to be at that point where you're you're really firing on all cylinders all the time in a day. Everyone has a peak of two hours, basically. I'm not on my peak, my attention goes straight after lunch. And, and that's when you need a producer to go, hang on, it's scene 43, it's scene 82. It touches into uh, real fandom that a lot of TV shows don't get. Um, and you have to listen to your fans. So it'd be very interesting to get the feedback from She's in London and see what we got right, what we got wrong, who was a standout, who gets killed off series two, <laughs> learn every day and, and that's what I always try and do. Um, I don't know all the answers, I didn't write the script. Um, so we go with the story that's presented in front of us and that's, that's always that ethic. You can plan and plan and plan, you can storyboard till the cows come home. The day will present you with what you're gonna get. Go with the team you've got, go with the day you've got and you'll have the best result. I think I'm going to turn Polly. Yeah. I think, uh...